What is y'all doing in my bed? Get out of my bed, you two. What is you doing in my bed? Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to another video. It's your boy EJ with NBO Kennel, nothing before family bullies, man. And I woke up to, um, to some crazy stuff, man. As you guys know, man, I'm super against dogs that's not that's not mobile, not able to, you know, do it right. And then I started thinking, like, why am I against dogs that don't do it right when human beings don't do it right? Most human beings sit in the house, chill, don't really do much. So them the type of dogs people need. People need dogs that don't really do it right. You know what I'm saying? So these micros, it's different. They don't even, like, people that buy micros don't even come come to people about, you know, fifteen hundred dollars, twenty five, it's just different, bro. It's XL dollars to sell for that much too. But what messed up what messing up the XL game is that people going to go buy cheap dogs and then get no line selling them and and y'all be thinking that if you go spend fifteen hundred that y'all got the same type of XL I got. Or the same type of XL that Boston Kennels got. The same type of XL that XCP got. The same type of XL that DDK, Mega Bill Bullies. Y'all think y'all got the same type of dogs that we got. I got, the, I got the same type of dogs they got. I got the same type of dogs that the big kennels got. I got they blood. I got the best shit. But y'all be thinking that y'all can go spend 1500 when I only spend 10000 Y'all be thinking y'all go spend... Two thousand when I only spent eight thousand on these dogs, and y'all think y'all got the dogs I got. You don't have what I have, and I notice you buy puppies. You see puppies stick down. Nah, nah, nah. You think that when the puppy get older, it's gonna look like my dogs? It's not. It's not. All puppies look good most of the time, bro. It's not gonna look like my dogs, bro. And you're gonna be so sick when them puppies hit a year and two years and three years and you looking at my dogs, looking at yours. Hey, why my dogs don't look like EJ's? Or why my dogs don't look like the bossy dogs? Or, bro, this shit costs money to look like this, bro. But you would think I'm for the ad. Make grows and Frenchies to the count. You better think again. All right. So last night, one of the boys was being aggressive over food, so he got put. To, he got sent to jail. Some water, some water, water. Look, look at him, locked up. Yo, I gotta build a coop, man. Cause this is a this is a dog pen. Oh, yo, bro, what kind of chickens are them, bro? The two big white ones. Like, hey, for real, bro. Matter of fact, what kind of, if you, if you didn't know anything about chicken, what kind of chickens are all of them? I gotta move this over some. I got a dookie right there in that spot. 
Well, what kind of chickens are these, man? Are these meat chickens? If they meat chickens, then they probably ready to be processed soon. See, I got my dog has a stack dude right there. Come on, baby. What you doing? Come on. So I had to pull the tape off all their ears. I left uh, the tape on the little run right here. She leave this week or next week. So she good. She can kind of take the stay on for a little bit longer. Everybody else tape came off. But yeah. Okay. For people that's interested in these puppies, we're hitting the 10th or 11th, I think the 11th week mark on the age. Soon, very soon, these puppies will no longer fit in carriers. If, you, if you're new here, um, welcome. Subscribe to the channel, man. Make sure you hit the like button and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any of my videos because I do upload every single day. For people that's been here and is interested, or the people that has bought puppies from me, or or people that's purchased one of these puppies, the time to get your puppy is now. All right, um, your puppies are ready, your dog's ready, your puppies ready. You want to get these puppies now, man, because soon they will no longer fit in the carriers on the plane. And you got to do ground shipping, which is a bit more. Check them out, get a good look at them. Look at those beautiful eyes. Look at those beautiful colors. He, he, his ears was antibiotic. He got his ears stretched last time. I think one of them got their ears stretched last time too, but I can tell he was one of them that got his stretch. Oh, fat stomachs, man. He's over drinking the water, man, but it is what it is. Yeah. Um, these puppies won't fit, uh, fit in carrier soon, man. So, whoever locked in a puppy, whoever paid your deposit, it's time to go and get your dog paid off. It's time to get your dog. It's that time. It's that time where you get your dog, man. Also, the puppies in the garage. That boy right there sold 
That cryptic mural right there. She's a cryptic mural. Big girl. Beautiful girl. Beautiful girl. It's available. Blue! Right there is available. The big one, I wasn't going to keep him, man. He is available. I only have one. I only have like three dollars available for Navy, y'all. Also, this is a Brenda. That boy right there. I know it's hard to see, but he's a chocolate Brenda. He got Brenda marks under his coat. You can see a real good design. That boy right there is available. You know what I'm saying? That's how we move it, man. We're moving and grooving. We're moving and grooving. We're moving and grooving. So I got all them dogs, uh, got all them kennels sprayed out, bleached, sprayed um, with the broom, cleaned out, clean. But what I do have to do is, I have to go to the store. You know what's kind of crazy, bro? Because listen, I put the wood chips in the pool, bro, for them to use it in the pool. They may pee in the pool, but they poop outside the pool. Also, I'm going to put AC units in here. Until the AC units get in here, this fan works really good. Woo! Back in the office. So yeah, I have to get ready to uh, get some of these dogs shipped out. I have a, sh uh, a shipper coming in soon to pick up a couple dogs to send them off. Um, like I said before, if you're interested, if you're interested in um, one of these puppies, man, the number and the pricing on the puppies will be in the description. Anything you need to know about the puppies. Uh, you give me a call. If you need to know anything more detailed of what I've shown you, just give me a call, man. 206-499-0422. Um, we're moving these puppies on out, man. These puppies are... Uh, it's time for them to go home. It is time for them to go home. Um, also, I'll be getting... Messages about co-own. All right, so here's how co-own work, man. Um, this is how co-own work, y'all. A lot of y'all get co-own confused, man. So this is how co-own work. If there's a dog, right, that I like a lot, that I want to keep, but I don't want to have to take the burden of having to pay for everything. I will sell that dog that I want for a cheaper price so I can have access to it. I'm not just selling. You can't come to me wanting to co-own one of my dogs. That's not how it works. If I have a dog that I want, but I don't want to take care of for real, I would offer it to co-own that. But here's the thing about that. I don't have any dogs. Okay, maybe one. Maybe maybe one or two dogs that I'm interested in doing a co-own with. But you, you guys don't get to pick what dog I would co-own. Understand what I'm saying? So if you're interested in one of the females, I don't, I don't need... There's not a female in my camp that I'm willing to co-own um, from Nyla and Zeus. There's no males in the camp I'm willing to co-own because I already have the blood and I'm keeping a female from that. So if I co-own a female with you and I already got the female of the same litter, it doesn't benefit me in no way. So on a co-own deal, it has to benefit both parties, okay? And me co-owning some of these dogs doesn't wouldn't benefit me because I already got the blood already. Makes sense. I already got the blood. I already got the daddy. I got the mom. And that's another thing. A lot of people do co-own shit, co-own stuff um, with dogs that they don't have access to because you know, like I got this dog and she's amazing. I don't have the dad. I, I pay for a stud credit. So I want. I still want to have access to that blood. I don't. I didn't pay for no stud credits with my dogs. You know what I'm saying? I own the males. I own the few. I bought all of them. Okay. 
So I don't need to, I don't have to, I don't, co-owning for me doesn't, it wouldn't make any sense for me. Um, just throw that out there so I let you guys know that. But the chocolate brindle, I have them listed, I think for, I'm not really sure what he's listed for. Um, I will do a co-own with him. The co-own with him would be, um, you pay me 2500 and I got three stud credits. That means when I need to pull from him for three three times, I don't need anything. I don't need any complications. Um, when I want to get him, I need to better come get him, have him hit three females, confirm three pregnancies, then I send them back to you, and we're done. You get the you get the papers for him. I don't I don't want to breathe with him anymore. He's all yours. That's how the co on work. Okay. Um, my blue Merle female. I'm thinking about keeping her, but. Um, since I have her brother, which is a Murrow, I will co, I am willing to co on her. Okay. The blue Murrow female, I'm willing to co on her. Hit me at 206-499-0422 to figure it out. Blue is for sale. The other, um, the other girl is for sale I showed you. Um, so I have a few females available. Also the white and blue male, the biggest male in that litter. The big, the big boy, the big navy, the big crazy boy. I am willing to co-own. Uh, he's for sale, but I am willing to co-own him from somebody because I kind of, I love all that white, and I kind of want to put him back to something. Uh, I kind of want him to hit the turner, just so I can have some blue tries. You know what I'm saying? So I am willing to do a co-own him. So hit me at two zero six four nine nine zero four two two. We'll figure it out. That's it for this video. I have a couple of errands to run. I need to go get some stuff for my chicken coop. Also, I need to go get um, um go get some stuff for the puppy, some more toys. Um, I'm not really, I wasn't true in, I wasn't really interested in buying a bunch of puppy toys because these dogs are for sale. But uh, they need some, they need uh, something to play with. The dogs in the backyard, they already got a bunch of rope in the backyard, bunch of rope in the kennel, balls and all that. They already got there, but these dogs don't have anything. So I'm gonna go get, I gotta go get Zeus, Roxy, Katana, um, some toys to chew on, some chew toys. And I gotta go get my keeper some two, uh, two toys. So I'm gonna do that today. Um, I might make another video today. If this video get 100 likes, matter of fact, if this video get 200 likes, I'll upload twice a day. If my videos get 200 likes, if this video get 200 likes, I'll upload twice a day. I do have tribes available. If you're interested in the tribe, this is your opportunity. This is your opportunity to get a uh, bossy blood, um, t um, 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 our job, um, NBF, you know what I'm saying? But this is your chance to get some of, some of the best blood in the game in a try, in a right eye try for a great price. Um, hit me at 206-499-0422. Anything you need to know will be in the description below. I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, I really appreciate you guys. Man, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. It's your boy EJ, and I'm signing out.